Analysis now from former federal prosecutor Renato Mariotti. Renato, Bannon's lawyer told the judge today, quoting now, what's the point of going on trial if we don't have any defenses? I is this a slam dunk, really, for the DOJ now? Uh, yeah, I mean, it, I have to say, this is an unforced error by Steve Bannon and his team. Uh, you know, well, Steve he's trying Bannon to sow chaos. It's what he always does. Well, I think that Steve Bannon has uh, pursued a very unsophisticated strategy here. That's who he is. That's what he always does, uh, as you point out. But I think uh, the reality here is when you're dealing with uh, a Congress and a Justice Department that it's going to move forward and, and try to enforce its right to this testimony, uh, a more sophisticated approach was warranted. And now I think he really doesn't have much to say at trial. The best move might actually be a blind plea of guilty in cooperation with the committee. Huh. You know, you know he, Bannon says he wants to testify live, which, of course, he does. Imagine that scene. The committee wants him private. What should the committee's next move be, Renato? I would, if I was the committee, I would, would try to seek... Uh, Bannon's testimony in private and full production of documents from Bannon before the trial date, which is literally a week from today, because they have leverage right now. Before, if, if he doesn't comply before the trial, that could be used against him at trial. Um, and so really, he could put up or shut up, so to speak. Uh, and uh, I think this is the smart way for the committee to determine, you know, what Bannon is willing to do when it has some leverage. Well, if he does testify before the committee, could that have any effect on the criminal contempt case? Well, the, 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 the judge says that the Bannon team can't use that in the trial. That's what he ruled today. As you pointed out, he pretty much lost uh, entirely a trial or in the uh, courtroom today. However, a smart defense attorney could try to sneak in the fact that he is now cooperating or find a way to get that before the jury could potentially influence things. No matter what, it would definitely influence the judge's sentence, I mm. think, if Bannon did come around. Renato Mariotti, thanks very much. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.